Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we are talking about another Korean beauty brand and this time we're talking about Isntree. So Isntree, actually I have discovered them through other brands like Yes Style and I have tried their sample product, I think. So but this time I'm trying their full products and they sent me this like really, really cute PR packaging that I posted on my Instagram, also my TikTok. So if you wanna check it out, go ahead, you can do that. Uh, so there's four products here. Uh, there's green tea toner. There is hyaluronic acid water essence. There is uh, essentially like sunscreen, which has hyaluronic acid in it. And lastly, we have AHA essence. So these are like very interesting products that I wanna get into them one by one to talk about like uh, what they are and like what is the inside of it uh, because they're so unique. I think Korean products are so cool. They have like very interesting ingredients and also not just that they have different purpose to it versus like the ingredients that are in america and the way that's purposed as so let's get started the first thing we should start is the green tea toner so actually i am generally not a big fan of toners because honestly in my opinion i think toners are for people who have oily skin or just maybe combination skin that they have kind of both uh, it's not necessarily for everyone so that's why uh, I think because I have normal to dry mostly dry face so this is not necessarily like something I would use on a regular day but I can use it like once in a while sometimes in the summer my face gets a little bit of oily but not as much so generally it's on the dry side because this really helps with like prevents greasiness on your face because if you have like oily skin you definitely have like you know like you just have greasy face so uh just normal if you have oily skin so this helps with that because this has green tea uh green tea just really helps with your skin complexion and it just really helps with just like smooth soothing out your skin uh because green tea overall is really good for you uh, the, the main difference i want to show you guys actually i'm gonna put this into this um a little bit of uh, you know pad so I can show you guys the color because uh, they were also saying this on the website as well because a lot of actually toners they kind of like diluting too much and they're not putting enough like using green tea because this is like more than 80% of green tea in it. The next product I'm gonna talk about is this actually AHS essence. So this is essentially like a AHA serum. Uh, so a lot of AHA serums actually, um, I mean, they're very good and they're actually super expensive. So this one is like pretty good bargain. Uh, so this one actually has 4% lactic acid and 4% glycolic acid. So these are kind of like uh, things that you would find I guess derived from milk uh, and that's just essentially how it helps you to just kind of like moisturize your skin and also make it more uh, silky-ish versus rough because um, I my skin is just generally super dry I don't know what's it about it um, it just is I don't know uh, I do use moisturizer <laughs> not all my, not like that many times but i use like in the morning and at night so just kind of it but so my skin is just generally very rough although the camera is not doing it justice but yeah generally it's very rough so this is the reason i wanted to you know try it and show you guys so it's very hold on let me so you guys see i love that my camera is not focusing but Oh, okay, this part shows better. It's very, like, silky-like. It's It also cleans your pores. So, um, another fun fact, I saw this on their website, which I had, like, wow, this is kind of cool. Uh, so you should definitely check that website, actually, isntree.com, because they don't just have, like, product, but they have so much information about the product, so you can just scroll through and read. You can learn so much about it, actually. So Cleopatra actually, like she was essentially using AHA. I'm pretty sure back then there was no such thing, but she was apparently carrying like milk um, with like the camels and everything. So, or the donkeys, I think. So like, you know, she can uh, use milk for her face and everything so she can have more silky like, um, you know, skin. So, and I feel it a lot. Like it's so like, 
soft and silk-like. And one thing I would say is actually there's some AHA serums and essence that I have used that like they're not bad, but they're kind of like mixed in with a lot of other things, and it's kind of so irritant. Almost all of these products that I'm talking about, they have almost zero, pretty much zero irritant on your skin, so you'll be totally fine. So perfect for sensitive skin as well. Uh, another favorite uh, product of mine, I think the last one, that's why I want you guys to watch until the end to see my favorite one, but this is another like favorite my, of mine. So this one is Hyaluronic Acid Watery Sun Gel. So you guys know I just love Hyaluronic Acid. I have talked about it quite a lot. So this is another product that has, that's essentially, that's sunscreen, uh, but it also has Hyaluronic Acid in it. So one thing I want to mention is that a lot of actually sunscreens that are for face, for some reason, they tend to just put like SPF 30. Again, there's like nothing wrong with that, but for me, like for me, SPF 30 is kind of like, no, nothing. Like, I mean, I guess in the regular day in New York City, it would be totally fine, but if I like were to go to the beach or somewhere beachy area, I would be burned. It's just not uh, ideal. So I would say definitely anything above SPF 40 is good for me. So this one is actually SPF 50, which is good. So for me, it's like generally for myself, like for my skin and for my body, everything has to be SPF 50. For my body, preferably SPF 70 if I can find it, but yeah. So what I'm trying to say is like more the better so you don't get burned. Uh, one thing I would also say is, so I will also want to clarify because in here it says SPF 50 plus, but also says PA++++ I think it's 4 plus or something like that. So SPF is essentially uh, protecting you from UV, uh, UV lights, but this is UVB, so ultraviolet B lights. Uh, then, but there's PA++, this actually protects you from ultraviolet A lights. So they're both kind of like UV lights that comes from the sun, so you need to be projecting yourself. So this has both, and that's very helpful. So, okay, this is the last product, and my favorite one, Hyaluronic Acid Essence. So uh, Hyaluronic Acid is something that, you know, your body needs and body produces generally, but, you, you know, over time, as we get older, it doesn't, so you need to apply it. So this is essentially what it is, and there are actually a lot of companies that are now doing Hyaluronic Acid serums, because it's just so popular now. But this is so, so unique because it's not just like one kind of hyaluronic acid. It has eight layers of hyaluronic acid from small, medium, and large molecules. So it's kind of company, like best of both worlds. So that it's coming together. So you can apply it to your skin uh, right before, I would say, applying to your moisturizer because I think moisturizer is the last thing you should do. Don't put anything on top of your moisturizer because that's essentially like a shield. So this is going to be like a shield for you, for your um, like moisturizing, moisturizing your face um, before you're putting that. So it's going to be like very um, hydrating because that's what the um, hyaluronic acid does. So, and because a lot of hyaluronic acids, they can kind of look like, what is it? Very transparent. So this kind of looks like a milky-ish because it has many kind of it and it's super soft little bit of like gel texture because it's essentially going to be like a shield on your skin and really uh, hydrating you if you have like dryness on your skin. I would say this is essentially for like dry skin but like there are type of the times of the year that a lot of skin types actually experiencing dry skin so I feel I would say any kind of skin would actually be um, able to use this. And it has no fragrance, none of these have any fragrance, it's all natural, yeah, nothing, no smell, anything like that, so it's perfect for sensitive skin, so. Anyways guys, so this was all the products, I will put the links down below, and thanks Isn't Tree for sending me these products. <laughs>